Uh, welcome back again. I'm going to work right now with the car of the real game. So actually finding the differences when I click with the mouse button. And I realized before that in addition to this three, there is another difference and it's actually this one showing here and not showing here so I'm going to add this one let me take it and this is the rectangle and I'm going to copy all the rest and so here we have our four differences not sure if just four or more but for the moment they are four so first thing we don't need to show these differences right now because that's the purpose of the game you have to spot the differences so we can remove all this rectangle but first we take this data and we put it um, down here we say we call it differences rectangles equals and then we create an array and add then one by one first then second third and the last one then we delete this and so we don't have them anymore we can delete even this countdown we don't need it because we have the bar um, where am i showing it uh this one probably time label okay then we have to work right now with our mouse so each time we click we need to get the position of the mouse so let's say mouse pause equals by game dot mouse dot get pause and let's for the moment print the position mouse pause and so I click and here we have the different position so let's do something else right now we compare each time we click with all this data to see if you uh, if you are actually clicking inside of these rectangles even if we are not showing them so we can say something for rect in differences rectangle differences rectangles and then we can compare them so uh, just to show now I'm I'm looping through them so print rect so each time I click the mouse this is the mouse position and then I'm going to print all of the rectangles position so I'm going to compare each time the mouse position with the position of this rectangle so I'm going to do something like if mouse pause zero so in this case I'm take, thinking just this number is greater 
then rect zero and so I'm taking this number and mouse pause zero is less than rect zero again plus rect two so what is this we're we're working now only with the axis and this is our game and here um, we have one difference that we want to match let's say that we click here with the mouse so we need to check if and um, I repeat now I'm working with just the axis is if our mouse is is greater than this x so if it's after this one and smaller than this x plus the width so it would be this number so smaller so it must be here inside so that's what we are checking now and so let's in this case let's say print got it else print you missed it and so let's run the game I click here and then we have for you missed it because we are checking for each time for each position for, for each rectangle let's try to get one so one got it and three missed it even if we click here down we it's one got it because we are working with the x so we are taking all this part and so the same here and we see that it's working properly now we have to do the same work for the y so let's just put this backslash and go down this we're just going to say python that we're continuing the code down with it because it's it's better to make one long line and for visual reason <laughs> and then and um mouse pause one is greater than rect one and mouse pause one is smaller than rect one plus rect three and then mm, I'm not sure if we can do this way. Okay. So what am am I doing right now? I'm, I am doing the same. So we are working with the X. So we are going to start from this point. And um, let's say I click here. I'm going to check if the mouse position when I click is here it was 21 it's greater in this case than 0 because this rectangle here above it's starting from 0 it's greater so the starting point here and smaller than this starting point plus the height of the rectangle so we're going to check if it's between here and here okay and so in this case I think the code is working properly no mistakes one got it let's say all missed it we've missed all 
in here okay and here I missed it okay it is working properly and now we are going to do something else um, I'm thinking yeah um, actually um, for this video it's all right now in the next video we are going to show the rectangle when we get the position so this is all for now, see you in the next video.